I'm now joined by Mr. Rahul Das, who is the Joint Chief Electoral Officer uh, and spokesperson of the Election Commission in Assam. Uh, Mr. Rahul Das, uh, welcome to this live broadcast uh, coming to you from the Northeast Live Studios. Uh, Mr. Rahul Das, uh, what is the polling percentage so far? Is the elections, is the voting going on comfortably so far? See all over the state as per report received, it is 10.14 uh, percentage as, as of now. So the uh, start kicked off very nicely. Uh, hope that it will continue. Yeah. So, b breaking news is that we'll update these figures on our tickers. 10.14 percent uh, polling so far. That is what the, uh, Mr. Rahul Das, Joint CEO, is saying. Yes, uh, Mr. Rahul Das, uh, so is there any uh, untoward incident anywhere reported? Is the uh, process going on very smoothly so far? No, it's very smooth till now. We got report of all the mock poll uh, report. If the starting has been um, done by all the district election office, the report has been reached this office. So all uh, the polling stations have started well till now. All right. Uh, Mr. Mr. Das, uh, you know, usually when uh, during voting, we, we always uh, at times get reports that, oh, EV, EVM malfunctioning and so on. But what about today? Uh, are there any reports from anywhere about EVM malfunctioning? Not major. We have got uh, some, uh, some replacement. It's 0.03% uh, or like that. Uh, so I have to confirm the figure again. But... Uh, but no, uh, nothing, no, uh, in any place, the poll is not disturbed for the fact. And this time we are having this M3 version of EVM VVPAT. So that's a better version and we are hoping that this uh, EVM functions well this time. We'll update the tickers. We'll also put up important points of what Mr. Rahul Das is saying on our slugs. Uh, Mr. Rahul Das, uh, you know, uh, I mean... What about what is the any 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 trends any interesting trend that you have noticed? Uh, for example, there is brisk polling in most of the constituencies. I, is there any anything significant that you would like to point out? <clears throat> no, but basically the there is not no no such issue. But the uh, feeling of the fact that the people are uh, coming out and celebrating the democracy very nicely. We are seeing we are getting pictures of people. Coming out in uh, large numbers, basically the elder ones, they have been seen, they have been uh, felicitated. The physically handicapped has been celebrated, uh, felicitated in some of the police stations. That is a very soothing pictures to see. Uh, in some of the district election office, the voters have been given the planned sapling. So the, all these things are uh, motivating to the uh, voters to come out. And many innovative things have been done by the district election office. So it's, it's, it's a good thing to see overall. Uh, Mr. Das, uh, you know, uh, led by your CEO, Mr. Nitin Khare, all of you, this time you have taken up massive COVID protocol measures. We have seen in our visuals, we are coming, we are getting live visuals from all across the, these 40, 47 seats. <laughs> yes, yes, the initiative that has been uh, carried out uh, from our leader, the CVS, electoral officer. Uh, so the message has been uh, forwarded well to all the districts. Uh, this is as per the ESA instructions. And uh, the district election office has done very well. Uh, so hope that these things co continues and we'll have a very nice election maintaining all the COVID protocols. And my final question, how is the situation along the interstate borders? Because... Uh, these 47 seats which are going to the polls in the first phase, you share border with Arunachal Pradesh, you share border with Nagaland and so on. Yeah, we have that, but that has been taken up by the civil electoral office. Uh, we, uh, the, the, the district election office had the uh, meeting also, interstate border meetings also. This government has also taken up the questionary steps. So we don't anticipate any, any, any issue on that. And how many polling personnel, can you give us an estimate how many polling personnel in all are involved in the first phase of the elections, roughly? Yeah, basically uh, the total figures is around 2.4 lakhs. So the, uh, the voters is 81 lakhs. Uh, the roughly it would be around uh, uh, one lakh or so. So we don't either don't have the exact data on the same at this moment. But uh, it will be like uh, the 47 LSCs, right? So it will be around one lakh ten thousand or so. 
one lakh ten thousand so more than one lakh poll personnel uh, is there any polling station uh, in in the first phase mr das which is inaccessible by 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 car uh, do, is there any polling station where people have to go on foot people have to trek yeah there are some two three uh, cases where where we have to uh, go, go a long distance but that, that all has been managed well by the district election office all the necessary arrangement has been done there have been boats are in place the um, shadow areas have been covered well by the police department also so all are in touch with us absolutely mr rahul das thank you very much for taking time and speaking to us uh